Hello, hello. Welcome to Shading White. I'm Marilyn, and tonight we have auction bags. We have gemstones, lapis, um, glass, pearls. Yay! If you haven't been here before, my name is Marilyn, my husband's name is Barry, and we are part-time resellers. We sell on eBay, Etsy, Poshmark, and YouTube. So anything you see tonight is for sale. We'll put a price on it. Um, if you are interested in something, you just send us an email to one shadyny at gmail.com and we um, will send you a PayPal invoice and your email to us. We just need your mailing address if you haven't purchased from us before, a timestamp or a screenshot. A screenshot of a timestamp is wonderful, a description. Shipping is $5 in the United States. Under a pound, anything over a pound or outside of the United States is based on where you're located and how much it weighs. So let's dive into this. This is such a cool um, two bags, as I said, from our local jewelry auction. Let's just jump right in. Let me get my little kitty. This is gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? I love this blue. Isn't that gorgeous? It is um, unsigned. I don't see a signature anywhere. Um, and it just slides on and clicks together. Isn't that nice? And it has a um, safety chain. Um, like I said, it is glass. Um, gold tone. The chain is magnetic. However, the little braces are probably brass. It is two and three eighths by about two and three sixteenths. I have a seven and a half inch wrist and it did fit me fine. Um, so I would not probably, there's some play, but I probably wouldn't go over a seven and a half inch wrist. So that's what I would say. I'm gonna say let's do for this glass, it is hollow. So I'm gonna say let's do $8 for the a blue, um, bangle bracelet. It's not a bangle. It's a um, hinged bracelet. Whew, that took me long enough to get. This is pretty. This is shell. Um, and these are they're cold. Um, but they could be acrylic, but they're faceted. And I believe this is brass, yeah. Uh, however, I maybe it's supposed to something go through here or something here, but there is no um, back on it. So I'm gonna assume it's a, a beautiful pendant. It is very, very big too. It is a four inches um, by two inches. But that is a beautiful piece. So I'm gonna say, let's just do $8. These are beautiful seed beads. These are done really well with red um, seed beads and black seed beads with black tubes. Um, very cool looking. Very boho. Doesn't look like anything's missing. It is pretty long. They are four inches by about an inch and an eighth, but they're pretty beautiful red. So I'm gonna say let's do $5 for the red seed bead, red glass seed bead um, earrings. And if you like I don't know if this is going to pull out of here. <laughs> this is gorgeous with the red. Isn't that pretty? Um, and these are unusual beads. The red is glass. 
they are gorgeous. And these are, I don't know, I'm going to say oval beads that have lines in the middle. And then they have glitter on the inside. Very interesting. Very beautiful and unique. I have never seen any like this. Uh, but it is a hidden clasp. And it doesn't say anything. Let's see if it is magnetic. It is not, so it's brass. But that is really, really pretty. Let's give you a measurement on this piece. I just love this red. And the shortest one is... 18 inches, um, so the red is the shorter of the two, but just gorgeous pieces. So I'm going to say with this one, let's do $10. That is so unique and beautiful. Here is another seed bead necklace. It's blue. Isn't that pretty? Um, let's see if these are magnetic. It's on a shepherd's hook. This is not magnetic. However, the shepherd's hook has slight magnetic. It is um, twisted. So twisted, let's give you a measurement. Hello. <laughs> 21 inches and that is twisted. So if you untwisted it, it would be longer than that. And like I said, it is a shepherd's hook. So I'm going to say, very pretty, let's do, let's do $12 on the blue seed bead. These are gorgeous seed beads. This one's also glass, um, a gold tone wire. And these are beautiful, gorgeous green. I mean, it is really beautiful. These are acrylic. This is glass. And these are, let's see if they're magnetic. They are not. It does have a gold wire in between. And that is 16 inches with the pendant being an inch and a half. However, the extension is discolored and it is three and a quarter inch. So I'm just going to say, let's do $5 for the green glass necklace. This is incredible. This is a bamboo and shell pendant. You haven't seen one of these. This is a shell. You can see the shell marks on the back. And these design has been punctured through. And then here's the bamboo on the bottom. Isn't that really, really pretty? Like I said, I haven't seen one of these. There is nothing missing on this one. Um, you just got to be sure to get all the pieces down. Nothing missing. It is three and five eighths by almost two inches. So I'm gonna say this is gorgeous. And I haven't seen one like this. I love this shell. So I'm gonna say let's do $10. Here we have a glass blue and orange um, glass. Did I say glass? Let's say glass again. <laughs> it is eight and a half inches. So that is pretty. If you're a Gators fan, Florida Gators, it's blue and orange. Hello, hello, Florida Gators. Um, but that's very pretty. So it fits lovely and it is a gorgeous color. So I'm going to say it does have, let's see. Yeah, there is some scratches. So I'm going to say let's just do $6. Let's see, is it magnetic? No. Let's test it real quick. That's a look of sterling. Yeah, so it's done in sterling. That's nice. That is very, very pretty. Lovely done with the um, 
double split bale. It is two and three eighths of an inch by an inch and a half. And it's really, really cool looking. It's a gray with a, a blue shimmer to it. So I believe it's a, a um, Labradorite. I believe that's what it is. It's gorgeous. It's sterling, a beautiful, gorgeous movement in it. So I'm gonna say, let's do, let's do $40. This is pretty and it is glass and it is a Chico's. Isn't that pretty? With the um, Melly, Melly Fiori. It's not gorgeous. I love it. I love this glass. It's a beautiful. And I love these swirls. It is 20 inches and the a drop is an additional four and a quarter inch. So that is really cool. So I'm going to say $10 for this one. This is just very nice. Now this one is glass. There is no name on it, so there you go. It's this piece and then a shorter one with an extension, and these are glass beads. The shortest one, oh, there's a hair. The shortest one is 15 inches with a two inch extension, and then the pendant is two inches by an inch. So I'm just gonna say $6 on this one. This one is really cool. I think it's um, dichroic also, possibly. Isn't that gorgeous? This is gorgeous, I think. Blues and orange and whites and greens. It's just a long necklace. So it is really cool, super long. It is... 32 inches with a three inch extension. So I'm just gonna say, let's do $8, very cool. Now this is shell and these are so cool. Look at these uh, beautiful shells, big chunky ones. And, um, but it is completely stretched out. Look at these charms on here though. There's, um, a starfish and a clamshell and they're held together with this thing but it is completely stretched out so I'm not even going to stretch it anymore because I think it will pop but this will be a great piece to restring so I'm and then it has these glass uh, faceted beads also that are kind of a corally color five dollars These are cool. These are, I believe they're, is that cool? They're inlaid mother of pearl into a wood, I believe. It's just unusual. They are two, a little over two inches and a half inch wide. But those are cool, aren't they? I think those are really groovy looking. Let's do $8. Those are cool. These are pretty. These are really, really pretty. These are green faceted. I think those are gorgeous. And they're just... Um, Acrylic, I believe. They're not even cold to the touch, but they are faceted and they are a gunmetal. So I'm just going to say $5 on these because they are really cool looking. Now, 
Now this piece I love. This right here is a pink quartz and so are some of these. Um, this one is right here. Some of these are just acrylic and but it is a cool looking bracelet. Isn't that cool? Look at that. I, I think that is so groovy. It is too small for me, okay? It is a toggle and it is eight inches. However, these beads really take up a lot of space, but I think you need to be definitely uh, seven and a quarter or smaller for this, but it's a gorgeous. I think this is just a stunning piece. So I'm gonna say let's do $15 for this one. I think that is one of the prettiest ones in this lot. This is pretty, this is um, brass wire and it is really cool in its glass and um, stone. This one's a stone, this one's a stone, this one's a stone. No, this one's glass and these are glass. So it's a mix. But that's what it looks like. Isn't that cool? I don't know. I just think that's one of those artistic cool pieces. It is, like I said, um, adjustable. Right now it is set at a seven, um, but it can be smaller or larger. So I'm going to say $10 for the blue stone ring and glass. This is a stretch bracelet with a dove. It's very pretty. I don't see a um, name on it. Let's see if it's magnetic. No? All right, let's go ahead and test the little bird because the bird's cool. Well, I guess it is. And there you go. More sterling in this lot. Okay. Um, this is really cool because it is, I believe it is a lapis. Um, because you do see some um, of the copper tones in here. Um, but it could be a mix of lapis and sodalite because, I mean, I see some white, but I also see the um, pyrite in there. Um, and then there's also glass beads. It's stretch, but really cool. So I'm going to say on the lapis and sodalite sterling, I'm going to say let's do $12. Cool. This is just weird, okay? It is really cool, but it and it is signed um, a U and I piece. If you've never seen that, that is what U and I um, jewelry hallmark looks like. It is on a gunmetal. With the extension fully extended out, it is still a very, very short. Um, gorgeous tiger's eye, okay? And it's one, two, three, four, five, six strands, okay? Unfortunately, this also has one earring. I'm like, why? Because the earring is so cool. Um... So I was like, maybe it's in there somewhere. But anyway, it's short. So I'm like, is it a bracelet? But all together, it is like only 12, 13 inches fully extended. So I'm like, maybe it's a bracelet? And why is it broke? Not broke, but like it's six strands on this one and six strands on this one. So I mean, that's interesting and all, but I just don't get it, I guess. So there's one earring and I'm gonna say this would look so cool as a bracelet. And Tiger's Eye is such a cool property. 
um, it gives uh, Tiger's Eye is a crystal with beautiful bands of yellow gold color throughout. It's a powerful stone that helps you release fear and anxiety and aids harmony and balance. It stimulates taking action and helps you to make decisions, understanding, and unclouded by your emotions. I mean, that's a really cool property. So I'm going to say because I'm unsure of it, I'm and it is great pieces. So I'm still going to say let's do $10 for the necklace slash bracelet and the one earring. That's a shame. That's a cool piece. This one is an agate, I believe. Isn't that cool? Beautiful. And it is on this silver tone. It is not signed. It is magnetic. It is 25 inches and the agate is an inch and three fourths, including the bell, and then an inch and a half. So I'm going to say, let's do $12 for the really beautiful agate. This one has glass um, stone and a silver tone. It is a chaps, um, beautiful piece, beautiful blue, but um, all different colors. And like I said, it is um, some glass, some stone, and um, by chaps. It is 17 inches with a two and a half inch extension. So I'm just gonna say, let's do $8. Now this is beautiful. It is not signed. And this has an enormous amount of scratches, which is a shame because it is a beautiful. But if you look at it the right way, you can see all the scratches. So this needs to be buffed to get all those scratches out. It has gold on the edges. And these are also agate. And these are faceted. I believe these are glass. So, I mean, it is a beautiful necklace. It was a really cool chain, too. So it is 30 inches with a two and a half inch extension. And this little slab is two and a quarter inch by an inch and a quarter. So I'm gonna say, let's do $10. That's a cool piece. Now this is a stunning. Okay, this, let's move that out of the way, is Spessardine Garnet. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. I think this is stunning. It is so rich feeling. And it feels that way too. It is... Let's get, 27 inches. It is on a barrel clasp. And this barrel clasp is older. So we know this is 1960s or older. Uh, 1970s or older. They were still using barrel clasps. Um, and these are just beautiful. And this is just like garnet. It stimulates the creativity of both energy and ability. And it encourages you to take action toward your dreams and visions and goals. It induces optimism, confidence, daring, and action. It's also um, a grounding stone and it is pragmatic nature of Virgo. Very, very cool. So this one, I'm going to say, let's do $18. That is gorgeous.
there is a chip right there on one, there's a tiny little chip. I don't know if you can see that. I'm trying to see, I mean, they're just so hard because they're so liquidy looking, but they're beautiful. So yeah, let's do that. Now this is another one, beautiful. It does not have a class. It is chips. It is 34 inches. And I believe this is sodalite um, because it's all white and blue. Let me see if I see any pyrite. Yeah, it's got pyrite in it also. Yeah, right there, right there. Okay, so this is gonna be lapis. Very pretty. Maybe this is that denim lapis that I'm reading about right now. Um, gorgeous chips. So I'm going to say let's do $20. Isn't that gorgeous? Love that. And this one. Isn't this pretty? I think of, once again, I believe it's lapis because there is your pyrite right here. Um, and I mean, it's pretty much in every single stone. And then it has that and a blue and a turquoise. It is stretch. Hope I don't pop it. <laughs> and there you go. Isn't that pretty? Let's get that off without popping. It seems like it's got a really good stretch, but I'm going to say $15. Here we have a Baroque Pearls. Um, stretch uh, very pretty I love those individual little pearls looking so beautiful like that start and stop to them these are just beautiful um, there's not a lot of stretch in this so unstretched completely it is two and a half inches and if I stretch it out just a bit it goes to about three and a half um, so I would not even put this on my wrist. So I think you need to have a uh, seven or smaller. So I'm going to say $10. This one is a, another one that is really cool, but these are a copper pearl. Isn't, aren't those just beautiful? These are just stunning. Um, once again, not a lot of stretch to it, but it is gorgeous. That rich old, uh, orange gold color. So I'm gonna say um, $10. And they are pearls also. Aren't those gorgeous? They're kind of a metallic with a little bit of that green color to them. These are just a beautiful. Um, I don't know what color they are. They're like a champagne with a green shimmer, like from um, that abalone. You know how it has that green shimmer to it? There's a hair right there. Got it out. So these are beautiful. Gorgeous. 34 inches with a 3-inch extension. So I'm going to say... $15 for these. These are gorgeous. Also, I um, did want to show y'all that I did have some bits and pieces bags that I promised that I would put up tonight. Um, the first one is this one. It is really cool. It's got some unique little pieces in here. Let me push that off. It has um, just some really cool pieces. It has some bracelets. It also has rings. Um, it is, I have to use my small scale. This one is a 4.34 ounces, and I'm gonna say $8, same as the one last night. So that's one. Two is this one. It has glass earrings, um, owl glass earrings. 
um, and some gold and black. It also has some sterling pieces, enamel pieces, and some marcasite pieces. And this one weighs 1.96, but this is a really nice bag. So I'm gonna say ten pounds, uh, $10 on this bag with the sterling. And then the last bag is this one. It has some necklaces, some bits and pieces, bracelets, um, and glass. Um, so this is a really nice piece also. And it weighs eight ounces, 8.46 ounces. And I'm gonna say um, $8 on this one also. So there you go, what'd you think? Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Be sure to um, subscribe below if you haven't already. If you saw something that interests you, definitely send us an email at one shadingy at gmail.com. And be sure you know we appreciate you spending a little bit of your day with us and we will see you on the next one.